Unfire erupts in a Brooklyn neighborhood. There was a shootout between police and an armed suspect. It left multiple streets riddled with dozens of bullets and the alleged suspect in the hospital. CBS 2's Alana Gold has new details. Investigators say the shootings happened at three different locations within about a mile of each other. We've just learned that 70 shots were fired. Most were right here along Broadway, where police shot and injured a 27 year old man. The intersection of Broadway and Jefferson Avenue is riddled with dozens of bullets. They pierced through the windows of a laundromat along with a truck and police cruiser just after one this morning. This afternoon, NYPD Commissioner Bill Bratton surveyed the damage at the scene. It's really crazy. I actually was looking out the window and I could see the cops. Shooting across the street. Van Cook woke up to the sound of gunfire right outside his bedroom window. And you can hear it on this nearby surveillance video. Sources say four police officers got into a shootout with 27 year old Gerald Harris, who allegedly led them on a chase through this neighborhood, then opened fire at them several times. Officers shot him in the leg. They were not injured. A little too close for comfort, definitely. The problems initially started on Madison Street. Sources say 52 year old Leon Faison had been packing up his Nissan Pathfinder for a family trip on this holiday weekend. When he walked away and left the door unlocked, Gerald Harris apparently he snuck into the vehicle. When Faison returned, he confronted the stranger. That's when Harris allegedly shot him in the arm and took off. I looked out the window and I saw somebody running down this way, but then that was pretty much it. It was pretty hectic. It was people just screaming all throughout the night. Police say the victim tried running after him and found some police officers. When the cops spotted Harris at Bushwick and Jefferson, they say he hid behind a police cruiser and fired shots at them. Those officers called for backup, and when they chased the suspect down the block to Broadway, he apparently ran towards them and continued to shoot until he was struck by one of their bullets. Police say they recovered his gun from the scene, a Glock 40. At this point, he's still recovering at the hospital, and criminal charges are pending. In the Bushwick section of Brooklyn, Ilana Gold, CBS 2 News.